By day, Little India is a sleepy town with stalls selling vegetables by the roadside and mama shops selling old school magazines. But when night falls, it's a totally different scene. There's Holland Village, Dempsey Road and Arrow Street. Little pockets of places where people can get away from the crowd and hustle and bustle of Orchard Road and Clark Key. Places where Singaporeans can go to chill out late at night. And now, we can add one more place to that list. Dunlop Street. This area in Serangoon Road where pockets of pubs, eateries and boutique hotels have popped up creating a whole vibrant atmosphere. Dunlop Street is off Serangoon Road in the midst of Little India just a few streets behind Deka Mall. Famous for its backpacker hotels, it has in recent times become popular with Singaporeans. What do you like about this whole area? It's somewhere cosy, remote, and not many people know this place. Normally people know the place, that's why you like it, right? right. Okay, so you want somewhere like not too crowded. Then. Yeah, exactly. When you first came to Dunham Street, right, what was your impression of the place? Um, something special. Yeah, very nice. It's like back to the 80s or 90s, huh? It's not very actually um, developed. Uh, it's actually my second time here. Oh, second time? Yeah, so like, I came here I guess a few years ago. Right. Uh, it's grew more vibrant. Uh, it's a like, very distinct difference from this lane and the others. This one is like a haji lane of sorts. It's a nice change from like Orchard Road or like, you know, rushing with the Friday crowd on, on like the weekends. Interesting, you get a very young crowd coming specifically to this area to just chill out and, and have a good time. So it's, it, but it's a very welcome change because at one point it was uncomfortable to be in this area, you know. Uh, maybe sometimes even in the daytime it can be uncomfortable because like I said, it's more of your family folks for the Indian community or your elderly folks, they are around the daytime. But at night it's completely taken over by everyone who's from a younger generation and that's really cool. Chinatown in comparison to Little India and we're saying that Chinatown just got too cleaned out and it just feels so sterile now. Whereas this area still feels very vibrant, yeah, which is seems like the authority has allowed allowed people to uh, change the use, but they didn't they didn't require them to clean it up, to redo the frontage, to paint, which is good. I think you know they leave it a bit dirty. It's like a twilight zone, you know. <laughs> the, the the minute like the next five minutes you're in a different place, the next few steps you're in a different place, you know. So that's how it is over here. It's like you can travel the whole world just by being here. Next up. We suss out the latest hip joints in Little India and explore boutique hotel Wanderlust which has just opened.